Hey there, Rediverse fans. It's Chris Rosario here, creator of Redemption, the series. We have over 100 subscribers. Um, that is an incredible milestone and hopefully one of many milestones. Of course, the next one we want to hit is 1,000. That's one and three zeros. There, there, there. That way, aha. Anyway, reach out to friends, family, random people on the street, you know, whatever. Let people know about this. If this is something that you care about, bring other people on board. If you just stumbled across this channel and have no idea what's going on, uh, down below right here, you're gonna see some links to, uh, I'm getting used to the camera guys, I'll, I'll get better at this. If this is the first video you've seen and you got no idea what's going on, why don't you check those out first and we'll kind of give you a better idea of this whole animated series and all of our spin-offs we're trying to produce. To commemorate the first 100 subscribers that we have, uh, we want to do a giveaway. Now, we don't have a big budget. We can't give away PlayStations and Xboxes yet. We're not at that level, but we want to be, so you know, keep an eye. We want to give a piece of promotional art. They'll be signed by both myself and also by the lead actor, Stefan Rosario, who is the voice of Redemption and of Jonah, and also happens to be my brother, in case you guys haven't noticed. Um, check out his channel here. He's also our head game designer. If you want to receive this poster, Leave a comment below. We'll do a random drawing and one lucky winner will be chosen. Is there anything I'm missing? Make sure that you guys rate, comment, subscribe, uh, start a dialogue. Let's get stuff going. If you guys got questions, ask. So we'll do a Q&A session. Whatever you guys want to know, ask it in the comments below. In the next vlog, I will answer your questions. So without further ado, guys, here is your video update. Reach out to people. Let's get our subscribers up. Comment below for a free sign poster and ask me questions so I can answer them in the vlog. I think that covers it, all right? So, um, you know, do, 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 do. No, not to because I can't do his thing, right? Um, uh, yeah, whatever. Don't. Um, basically, she is a high school girl trying to figure herself out. Well, she's been involved in the Hosun gang for a while, and she's starting to get out and realizes that she wants other things in life. Well, I think it's like a lot of things in life. Once you're sucked into something, it feels like a good idea at the time, and then you find out what it's about, and you realize that it's not really doing anything for you anymore, and you need a change. I think the, the main thing that switched her was she met um, the character Jonah and she kind of, he's a sweet guy, a guy who is very, um, you know, save the damsel in distress type guy. So she's like, oh, I can, I can use him. I can do something with this. There's more that I could get from him than I'm getting right now. Hi. Hi. I was worried you got hurt. You saved my life and I freaked out and ran. It's okay. No, it's not. Let me make it up to you. Could I buy you lunch? Um, basically, um, Chris's brother, Stefan, goes to my school and so he was like, hey, does anybody want to be in this series that I'm creating, a new superhero? And I was like, yeah, that sounds really cool. So um, I auditioned for it and I got the part of Aphrodite. And I was like, this is really neat. I'm a more of a theater actress, but film is always something that I've really wanted to get into, especially like movies and things like that. So I think this is definitely a step into the world of the film theater. Stop it! Please leave me alone! If you think I'm gonna shut up and make this easy. Do you have any personal connections with Mickey? Like character-wise, what she does, how she dresses maybe? Um, definitely how she dresses. <laughs> I think we have a similar style because we are, well, I'm in high school and she's in high school, so it's kind of the same. But in the personality-wise, I'd say we are very different. Just because it's hard for me to be like all sultry and manipulative, and she's kind of the polar opposite, I guess. I'm one of those people who I'm straightforward about everything. It's like, this is my agenda, this is what I want to do. Here, let's have fun together. And she's more like, okay, we could do this, but this is what I really want over here. No, 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 it's okay. It's for a movie. <laughs> We're just doing a school project. With Chris? Oh, I love working with Chris. He is so much fun. Um, that's basically the word that I would describe him is pure fun. 
because every time I come around him, it's like I'm always laughing. It's it doesn't really feel like like this entire time. It's never once felt like work. It's been let's do this. This is great. <laughs> That'd be terrible if someone was like in there going, oh, no, no, I don't think so, because I just see her crying. Like, oh, God. Okay. <laughs> it's happening again. Because we'll find out in a second. The voice is the voice. <laughs> all right, Megan. Okay. It's, it's all you.